superhero Her desire sharp mouth has reduced, but personally, I think it's because she's scared. She doesn't know what to choose. <laughs> Prayerfully, she makes the right choice, and hopefully, the right choice gets me back at work next week. Okay. But see, then, hello, I'm enjoying this rest. Hey, uh hey, -huh, babe, this one that you're chilling at home, hope they'll pay you. I doubt it, though, unless they find me innocent. Bill, hmm, anyway, <laughs> how are your hot men in your mom boutique? <laughs> No be any man boutique, I beg you. I'm sure not talking to Midi. Now what for now? People like fights past quarrel. This particular one is on him. After everything that happened, can you imagine he called me? Oh, why would you collect money from an artist? If you knew you needed something, why couldn't you ask me? Wow, hey. wow, 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 wow. <laughs> Sugar daddy, yeah. baby boy, yeah. Mr. Midi on the loose. Oh. Wants to spend some D's on you, and you know, dollar is now the new crude oil in Nigeria. He wants to spoil you, silly, yeah. my dear. You will be like rotting plantain <laughs> that is one month old, soft. Ah, Obina, look at what men are doing for them. <laughs> you be fool. <laughs> but really, how could he? Th I thought he could think better of me now. Well, truth be told, he doesn't know you any better. He wanted to, but you did not give him the chance. Oh, please. We spent times in his office, day in, day out. Mm. I mean, he knows me to a certain extent. Babes, he knows you as an OAP. He wanted to get to know you better, but you did not let him. Mm. All right? So you should try to see it from his own point of view. He really, really doesn't know you. Don't blame him. This mm. one that you are not at work today. Won't you uh, find something to do to keep yourself busy? I'm on vacation, mommy. People on vacation tend to just do nothing but laze around. No, no. But you are too comfortable now. Mm. But people like you look for extra work to do to make money. Wow. Can you work better? Okay. Yeah. Anyway, um, I sent Osila to the market. So please. Bami Losino uh, Iyara, get my painkiller, go the branch to the kitchen, and then um, get my water from the fridge. Oshie. Thank you. Oshie, dear. Mommy, I'm busy. Ah, you are busy. Ke. So, painting of nails, Lataro. Jagagabi, being busy, Abi. You are not doing anything, my friend, so. George, 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 shake your head, damn long. When you will still have come back? Uh, you can go and bring her from the market, Yotibo. Ole, Uli, lazy thing. Jo, go, 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 To find something to do myself all this spare time. I can't call Nathan because I don't want to give him the wrong idea. Can't call me day because, well, I'm still mad at him. Diddy's at work. 
Falake is in baby heaven in America. Shaliwa is at work. I need to find something to do or find someone to keep me company and busy. Auntie, well done, no? Ah, we'll see. Thank God. You did well. Now, like this mommy, they send you up and down message. Now, so, if to say she fit send me, go heaven, go bring Jesus, she go send me. Chai, well done. Mm -hmm. Hello? It's been a week, Tiwa. I gave you time to forgive me, so forgive me. Okay, forgiven. I was quick. I was that quick. Like you said, it's been a week. I mean, a forgiven spirit, so yeah. Forgiven. Tell the truth. Well, I'm at home doing nothing, so my mom keeps sending me up and down the whole place, and in fact. Ah, so I lied. Up and down the whole place. Oh, okay, I'll wait for you. <clears throat> Please hold on one second. <sighs> for what now? Mufa Jadi. Eh, so what happened? So what happened? Ah, she, you are at home, madam. I want to make a query, and you know that the driver is not coming. Polo sick. Ah ah. Well, expect to keep my drive, Kakiri. Why you are there? Ah. Anyway, whoa. I want to get to Ikeja, but before Ikeja, we branch at Bagada because I want to see uh, Mama Risi. Uh, then um, we head up to uh, where we're going. Well, mommy, I'd really love to take you out, but I can't right now. I'm on the phone talking to someone who wants me to host an event. I'm meant to meet up somewhere to have a meeting today, so I can't drive you anywhere. I'm sorry. Ah. Yeah. Koburu. Oda. Mm. Where are you? My house. Doing what? I had an early outside the office meeting, so as soon as I got that done, I came back home. Are you alone? I live alone. Why do you feel unsafe around me alone? Because I feel unsafe with you, only with me. Why? You keep bottling your feelings, so who knows? You might just jump me. You know what? I'm taking my forgiveness back. Take it back. Have fun driving your mom to Ikeja. And you should change your name to, to Mukaila or something. You try ballast. All right, say please and I'll send my address. Please what? Say please, me day, my darling. I am sorry for holding my forgiveness for so long. Forgive me and give me the address to your lovely home. <laughs> You're on cheap drugs. Fine. Bye. Oh yeah, wait. Please, me day. I am sorry for holding my forgiveness for this long. Please. Oh God, go. my darling. And at the end or the beginning of the name will be, you know, suitable. Please, me day, my darling. I am sorry for holding on to my forgiveness. Do send me your address so I can show it to you. Perfect. All right, I'll think about it. Olumide. You make my full name sound so sexy. Please, okay, bye-bye. Okay, okay. I'll send it to you. Go and take a shower now and come, huh? How do you know I haven't taken a shower? Wild guess, Stinky. All right, see you in a bit. I'll cook. You cook? I can do a lot of things, baby. So come through me now and I'll show you. Is this a safe idea going to this boy's house? Especially with the last statement he just made. I feel like a deer walking itself into a lion's den. What if he tries something? Hmm. He dare not. What? You like what you see? No, just... It's a bit weird seeing something other than a suit, that's all. All right. And you? Keep your thoughts to yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm yeah. not going to jump you, I promise. But I can see whatever it is I'm thinking. This is my house. Fair enough. Right, come here, come here, come here, come here. Welcome to my boat. This looks quite like the bachelor pad. I am a bachelor. Please sit down. Thank you. I'm going to get you something. I'll be right back. Huh? Okay.
There you go. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Mm. Mm. You cooked this? Yeah, I did. It's nice. Can't you the gracious host? All right, yes, I am. <laughs> Anytime. So, what's up? Anything new? Nothing much. How's your boyfriend? I don't have a boyfriend. Please. You get off the phone with me so you can talk with him. That doesn't make him my boyfriend. Well, it does make him more important than I am. Whatever. How's Nadine? How did Nadine get into this talk now? Last time I saw you two together, you had your tongue down her throat. Yuck. Things kind of went from bad to worse on the day she called you. Oh, wow. Can you imagine she, she went through my phone to get your number? You don't lock your phone? No, I don't. Except I'm in a relationship, of course. Oh, that's that now. We're hoping for, you know, some happy endings. Tiwa, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Yeah, sure. Okay. That day you came to the office and you saw Medina Nike's. What did you want to tell me? It's really not important anymore, moving on from it. No, it's important to me, because after that day, everything just flipped. I mean, you came in, you saw us kiss, and then you basically acted like you were heartbroken for three months. I listened to every one of your shows to be sure and to, to find out what the problem was, but I didn't get it. You acted like I cheated on you, when in fact it was you that rejected me. Like I said before, it's in the past. Let's leave it where it belongs. You're just a coward. How does cowardice have to do with this? It's been six months. I'm trying to start something new with Nathan, plus I'm sure you have like one or two girls lurking somewhere, so. Wait, you're not going to tell me anything now because you haven't Nathan. Something like that. Wow, all right. I'm just going to assume that you came to the office to tell me that you liked me and you wouldn't mind us dating. Haven't you heard about assumptions? <laughs> You must really like me a lot more than I thought for you not to be able to talk about something you said you've gotten over. Me day? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> You're so full of yourself. Really? Yeah. Stop assuming things when you don't even know the facts. All right, prove me wrong then. I don't need to. So you're telling me now that you lied and I should basically just accept what you said? No, I didn't lie. I've moved on. Okay. <sighs> All right, so... So anything about me is done, right? Done? No emotions, no feelings, nothing? Nothing at all. Okay, how about we put that to the test then? Okay, how? Okay, the truth is you, you were right. There's someone lurking in the background for me. I'm also <laughs> thinking of moving on with her. I knew it, I knew it. Why are you shouting? You're not supposed to care about all these things, no? I don't. Okay, so. How about... We we're friends, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. So, I think it's proper for our significant others to, to meet each other. What do you think? So, what, like a double date? Yes. Okay. A double date. Yeah. Where, place, time, let me know. Great. I'll, I'll send it to you. Great. 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 This dude is really, really, really starting to frustrate me. And he's going to get burnt, but I'll be there to watch it. <laughs> So Tiwa, what you're trying to say to me is that you're going on a date with me day. Mm -hmm. But you're not going on a date with me day. You're actually going on a date with Nathan. Exactly. And Mide will be there with his latest flavor of the week. Um, what exactly is the point of this outing? To show Mide that he does nothing for and to me. He needed proof, so I'm going to give him proof. But you and I both know that that is a lie from the piece of hell. And Mide knows that that is a lie. Mm. And hopefully, Nathan will find out that it's a lie. It's not a lie. Um, that is what you tell yourself. Tell yourself that so you believe it. <laughs> See, Nathan and I, we can have something really great. We can start on a fresh page. See, I'm tired of all these Lagos boys and their Yoruba demon ways, though. I'm done. Wow. And it is Nathan that is not a Yoruba demon. Mm -hmm. Nathan is the exact example of a Yoruba demon. No, like for real. He's too sweet. 
he's such a diabetic character. Like even his sister, I'm being serious. His sister even says it. All his friends are women. And they've never dated who, but they always just have something. Oh, Charlie Wally. And you know them personally? No, that's not the point. The point is, guys like that know exactly what they're doing. They know exactly what to say, when to say it. They know exactly what to do, when to do it. They're too calculating. There's always a motive behind guys like that. <laughs> she psychoanalysis too bad. I'm being serious. It kills you, please. Small sweetness he has shown you. All of a sudden, you're angry. Why tighten the world to your chest? This is how I warned you about color, but you still carried yourself there. Oh, shut up, please. Me is not any better. He's a cheat. Oh, wow. This confirmation of his cheating stems from what? The fact that you caught him cheating his ex after you rejected him? No. The girl he was kissing was his ex fiance whom he cheated on, which was why she broke off the engagement with him. Hmm. Someone that broke off the engagement is calling you. Mm -hmm. Marking territory, telling you to leave her boyfriend alone. Hmm. Shalewa, that's not the point. He cheated. Cheated. She deserved it. Nobody deserves to be <laughs> cheated on Shalewa. Trust Nobody. Me. She deserved it. Because I don't understand how someone who claims someone cheated on them is begging him, going to kiss him now. All of a sudden, she wants him back. She's just a very hungry girl. Shalewa. Hmm. I've said my own. In fact, Nathan is not even any better. What am I saying? That one doesn't even work. He's still here doing daddy's boy, collecting money from his dad. I can't stand him. Mide, on the other hand, is working. Very level-headed. And he's very handsome, actually. Wow. I've already bribed because Mide has bribed you. He didn't bribe me. But let's be very, very honest now. Mide has stuck around. He's been there for you for months. You need to see the way he looks at you. When you're not looking, like for real. Now you won't let him go on a date with another girl. Mm. If I were you, go on that date, fail that test, and bring your man back home. I don't want me, day. I don't want him. I've told you my own. <laughs> we shall, we shall see. Why are all these people not believing me when I say I don't want me, day? I don't want him! I'm not attracted to him! Good afternoon, Ma. Hey. Good afternoon, Tiwa. How was your holiday? It was fine, thank you. I've looked into the scandal, and your story has been confirmed. Nick Anderson also verified your story. The station has put out a statement, and we've received an apology. Okay, that's good. I'm just happy that the truth has come to light. And I try my best to avoid any form of scandal, so I'm just, I'm happy. As I was concluding the investigation, Hadiza comes out. I've called in the MD to intervene because left to me, she'd be fired. Uh, I'd like Hadiza to stay. She's a great OEP. I mean, her personality needs to be worked on. Hadiza? Sir? I hope to God that I'm not making a mistake. If this should happen again, I will not hesitate to fire you. And I'll take legal action. I swear that this would never happen again. You ought to your own apology. I go, ma. Now would be a perfect time. <laughs> I knew my God would bring this girl down to earth. <sighs> Tio, I'm sorry. Apology accepted. I don't care for all this crime, so please, the minute you confess, you were stripped of your title. The title will go back to Tiwa. Thank you very much, Ma. I would do my best not to disappoint you. You better not. And don't even think about it. Please find someone to cover for Hadiza. She'll be suspended for one month. <laughs> okay, Ma. Thank you very much, Ma. All right, uh, I'll be on my way. Seems like I have this coffee already. Yeah, thank you, Mide. Right. Uh, Tiwa, Hadiza? Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma. Thank you, ma. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. why are you here? No more, sir. <laughs> Bye-bye. 
Oh, you don't like me calling you sir? No, no, I don't. But I, it's nice to see you show me some respect because of Kate. So what, well, Kate likes you? Do you like me? Whatever. So where are we going to tomorrow? I need to let Nathan know so I can free his schedule. Okay, uh, trust me. If Nathan knows that his absence means you're going to spend the time with me alone, he'll make you his only shadow. Whatever. Can I have my chair back? Karaoke? Yeah, I really do. I used to do it a lot back when I was in the US and back when I was in England. Oh. I love it. So you can sing, huh? Yeah? 